Hello guys and welcome back into a new brand video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change the lightning settings on the Roblox Studio. So make sure to watch the video to the end and follow these simple steps. So first you will need just to have your Roblox open and then we need just to go to the Word or uh, the plates or any templates where we want to start adding our modification. So basically I'm just going to add a new and I'm going to go to any other templates that I have here. And basically here we will find our workspace and here we can find our lightnings. So basically if you want to change the lightning settings, you will need just to be on the lightning area or lightning objects here and we can start adding or uh, changing on the lightning settings or properties. And basically, if we click only on the objects without going to the other layers or other objects, uh, sub objects, we can find these properties here, like the color shift bottom, brightness. And of course, if we add the brightness, we will have our world that will be uh, that will start changing the lightning. If we go to the color also, we click on OK. And for the ambient lights, we will have uh, the lightning. So let's just make it. Uh, here and as you can see for the these lights on the corners or the ambient lights we can find that it's become more brighter rather than darker and also this can uh, apply on any other property of the lights also if we go for example for the atmosphere we can see that there is this density and you can see that it will become clear like we will have clear uh, mid uh, weather or something like that foggy and you can uh, add other the color for example the color for, of the fog i want it to be for example like that as you can see it will start also changing the mirroring and we can go for the sky and also change the other all the other uh, settings and basically this uh, modification and how to change lightning settings can apply on any templates and it can apply also on any object so basically, if you want to change any object property, you click on the object and here we will find the property menu or panel. And then you can start like modifying on its settings or properties. So basically, this is how you can do it. Thank you for watching and see you next time.